guys. We are ready for Saxon Lesson 61. Today you are going to start with the packet that has spelling list 12 on the top. So find that list, put your name at the top, and let's look at your spelling words. All right, we have several rules going on with our spelling words. All right, you'll notice we have lots and lots and lots of blends reviewed in our lesson. Almost every word has a blend or a combination in it. We have lots of reviews of bossy R rules. We have O-R, E-R in some words. The final K sound is reviewed. And then you're going to have sight words as your challenge words. 16 through 20 this week. So let's look at your words. All right, word one. Let's sound it out. Sp in. What word? Spin. Number two. B um. What word? Bump. Next word. Number three. Sound it out. App, scrap. What word? Scrap. Like extra paper or extra material will be scrap. The leftover. Number four. Sound it out. Melt. Melt. Number five. Melt. Smell, floss roll. Number six, quest, quest. Number seven, art, art. Number eight, k cord, cord. Number nine, Brush, brush, ten, shock, shock, number eleven, K cook, cook, twelve, K Cluster thirteen D oh. Eel. drill fourteen us fuss fifteen Ch um. champ. All right now our sight words, our funny words. These all have a star beside them because you cannot sound them out. You just have to memorize how to spell them. Our number 16 is R. What word? Yes, R. Spell it. A-R-E-R. -R. 17 is said. What word? Yes, said. Spell it. S-A-I-D. Said. 18 is says. What word? Yes, says. Spell it. S-A-Y-S. Says. 19 is want. What word? Yes, want. Spell it. W-A-N-T. Want. And number 20 is what. What word? Yes, what. Spell it. W-H-A-T. What? I know your sentences. All right, you have two different types of sentences. 21 is a declarative or a telling sentence. It is going to end with a period. All right, put your finger under the first word and let's read it together. Jim 
felt the bug on his arm. Jim felt the bug on his arm. It's telling you something. So it ends with a period. Every sentence begins with what kind of letter? A capital letter. All right, Jim is also a proper noun. So even if that word were somewhere else in the sentence, it would still need a capital letter. So we need a capital J in Jim. Put a space in between each word and make sure it's spelled correctly. All right, number 22. This is an asking sentence or interrogative sentence. Let's read it together. Finger underneath that first word. Let's read it. Which girl made the black dress? Again, which girl made the black dress? All right, every sentence begins with what kind of letter? Yes, a capital letter. So we have a capital W in which. It ends with a question mark because we're asking a question. We need to make sure every word is spelled correctly and we have a space in between each word. All right, in the lesson, I will include the link for you to get to Spelling List Practice 12 on Spelling City, or you can practice some other way at home. But your test will be at the end of the week. All right, so practice these words. All right, when you turn the page, it is backwards again if it is the copied one from the office. I'm sorry. I know they copied it backwards. I apologize for that. So you have to turn it one more time to the front. The name portion will be up here at the top and it will say Lesson 61, Sound Spelling Review. At the top, we're going to focus on Diagraph AI today. Name at the top and then eyes ready for our review. Before we start on naming the letters, let's go over some sounds. It's been a little while. So let's see what you remember. Cow. Diphthong O-W says. Ow. Diphthong O-W says ow. Bow. Digraph O W. Yes, O. Mouse. Diphthong O U. Yes, ow. Soup. Digraph O U. Wreath, ghost letter digraph, W-R. Yes, uh. Nat, ghost letter digraph, G-E-N. Mm. Not, ghost letter digraph, K-E-N. Name these letters. Combination ER. Digraph EA. Combination IR. The vowel Y. Digraph PH. Ghost letter digraph GN. Final stable syllable TLE. Final stable syllable FLE. Diphthong and digraph OU. Diphthong and digraph OW. Ghost letter digraph WR. Final stable syllable BLE. Combination QU. Final stable syllable GLE. Combination AR, ghost letter 
square digraph K N. A consonant E. O. Combination W H. I consonant E. Combination O R. I fix cards. All right, these are suffixes added in, added to the end of a root word will change the meaning of the word. This is suffix Y, suffix ER, suffix EST, suffix ING, suffix S, suffix LESS, Suffix ed. All right, side word cards. Read these the fast way. Bush, none, you, do, trouble, don't, eight, by, should, many, today, there, a place, every, said, Says to have put together push were tomorrow where some won't would are from only who the won't does into something goes could all right look at your sound spelling review number one an echo me number one s yes s two ways You should have S, final S, S. Number two. Mm. Yes. Mm. It's a digraph. Write it. You should have digraph T, H. Number three. Position. Write it. You should have O consonant E, O with a macron, final O W. Remember, digraph O W, like in bow and snow, says long O. Number four, dull. Yes, dull. Write it.
we should have U consonant E and U with a macron. Number six. Yes. Write it. One way in the initial position, one way in the final.
the word is fake. Fake. The doll is fake, but it looks real. Fake. Tell me the sound you hear in fake. Get ready. Fake. Again. Fake. There's something sneaky on that word. Fake. Write it on number 12. F-A-K-E, what word? Yes, fake. Sight words, funny words. Number 13, done. I am done with my work, done. Spell it on number 13. Let's spell every E V E R Y. What word? Every. Number 15. Many. Many. I like to see many of you. Many. Write many on number 15. Spell many. M A N Y. What word? Yes, many. All right. Now we're going to practice writing a sentence today, just like you have to do sentences on your spelling test. All right. Remember, with a sentence, every sentence begins with a capital letter. In between words, we put spaces. And then we have to end with some type of punctuation mark. All right, pencils down and listen. We're going to write the following sentence on your paper. Check the room and see if it is clean. Listen again. 
check the room and see if it is clean. Say it with me. Check the room and see if it is clean. Your turn. Yes, check the room and see if it is clean. Write your sentence on number 16. Check the room and see if it is clean. Check your sentence. Every sentence begins with a capital letter. So capital C and check. Check the room and see if it is clean. All right, that is a bossy sentence or imperative sentence. So it ends with a period. So check your sentence. Make sure it is correct. and listen for the sound they all have in common. Mail, train, faint. One more time. Mail, train, faint. What sound do you hear in all of these words? Yes, a. Very good. Let's look at these words and see what's making that long a sound. Mail, train, faint. Boys and girls, what's making the A sound in these words? Yes, it is A-I that is making the long A sound. All right, what do you think A-I could be? It's a digraph. Right, it's a digraph because we have two letters that come together and make one sound. That's right. How do we code digraphs? We underline them first. 
right? And if we know the sound that they make, we can code it. And in this case, we can hear the sound they're making. So, we know it's AI. And it's making the A sound. So, which one should we put the macron on? The A. So, the A is doing the talking and the I is doing the walking. So, let's cross that I out. Two letters that come together and make one sound. So, we're not hearing the I, we're hearing the A. In this one. Mail, train, faint. Long A sound. new card for these. Alright, digraph AI, what will we say? Yes, digraph AI. Alright, now I have a riddle for you for our keyword picture. This is something that is wet. You find it outside. It comes from a cloud. It gives our flowers grass and trees a drink. What do you think it is? 